हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू आई एग्जाम बी आज के इस वीडियो में हम जिस टॉपिक के बारे में डिस्कस करने जा रहे हैं वो कई बार एग्जाम में पूछ लिया जाता है जिसका नाम है एपीकल्चर सो एग्जाम में फुल स्कोर करने के लिए इसकी कंसेप्ट की क्लैरिटी प्लस इससे रिलेटेड जो कई बार क्वेश्चन पूछे जा चुके हैं उनके बारे में हम इस वीडियो में डिस्कस करेंगे सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वॉट इज एपीकल्चर एपीकल्चर इज एक्चुअली द रियरिंग ऑफ हनी बीस और द मेंटेनेंस ऑफ बी कॉलोनीज इन मैन मेड or artificial heights now here we will study about some of the bee species that are mostly cultivated in india so the popular one are apis sarana which is also known as indian bee apis mellifera which is also known as european bee now this european bee is also known as italian bee specifically apis mellifera lingustica Apis dorsata is also known as rock bee or giant bee it is the largest one in size followed by apis mellifera and another name of it is dumna and the red dwarf honey bee that is apis floria which is also known as little bee these are the four cultivated uh, bee species and this one is the stingless bee this is a very efficient pollinator but from honey production point of view this is less efficient so this is uh, this stingless bee is also known as melipona eridipennis and it belongs to meliponini so this is also known as damner bee, damer bee also we will study about national bee board now this national bee board is comes under ministry of agriculture and farmers welfare under government of india and this was actually started in 2000 under SFAC it is small farmer agri business consortium and was established as a society by society regulatory act of 1860 again was inaugurated in 2006 then we will also study about NHBM which is national bee keeping and honey mission this is a central sector scheme and is uh, being uh, in continuation since 2 years so 2018 and 19 now world bee day is celebrated on 20th of may this apis sarana indica is used for commercial purpose for honey production in india apis mellifera is commercially used all over the world for honey production because the honey production in this case of uh, apis sarana is approximately 8 to 10 kg per colony per year and in apis mellifera this is So there are about 25 to 40 kg per colony per year. Apis dorsata produces maximum that is 50 to 80 kg, but this is highly aggressive species, so it is hard to be domesticated. It comes under the wild species and produces a, a colonies generally in the open areas. And this little bee produces uh, lower honey, means from yield point of view, it yields results in lower honey production. somewhere about 200 to 900 g stingless bee is efficient pollinators but the honey production is low somewhere around 300 to 400 g of honey per year per colony now we will study about different classes of bees there are three different classes queen worker and drone among these only queen is fertile and lays egg the worker bees are sterile and generally are involved in several kind of activities that takes place in the hive uh, together with nursing of the queen bee and drone is the male which also uh, is produced from the sterile eggs of workers and this is haploid so its prime function is only mating generally in india the uh, the, uh, the cells of uh, containing dro drones have larger capping so they are decapped they decapped because these drones consume on the honey that are being produced okay so queen about queen we know we should know that it lays about 1500 eggs a day and after somewhere 6 to 8 days this leave the colonies and is involved in a nuptial flight nuptial flight is also known as marriage flight which takes place about 30 meter above the ground and is important for mating so here virgin queen mates with a uh, drone and then fertilize and then it lays eggs life span of a queen bee is about 5 years but the egg laying capacity is only up to 2 years 
Then there are workers which are involved in different activities like foraging, defending, brood rearing and cleaning. The defending workers generally have the sting. And drones do not have sting, they lack stingers but they, and they are haploid. Now these are some of the beekeeping equipment. This one is beehive. This is a smoker which is used to make bee docile. Uh, hair smoke is produced from the fire that is ignited from the chamber. And this one is the division board. The mere division board. This is a queen cell protector. It is actually cone shaped and is made up of wire that is wrapped around the queen cell. And this is a drone trap. Rectangular in shape and open from one side. Now there are some terms which are commonly used in apiculture. The first one is swarming. So swarming is a natural means of propagation uh, in the bees. And generally uh, swarming is when the bee population is at its peak and uh, the whole hive is very much crowded. So some of the uh, honey bees they leave this colony means a single colony is divided into several separate colonies and some of the colonies uh, that are formed leave the hive so that is swarming so it is a natural mean that happens generally it is also important for the mating point of view then absconding is actually abandoning of the hive mostly due to some disease that could occur in the hive or due to the attack of wax moth Nuptial flight is marriage flight that is done by a virgin queen and it takes place about 30 meter above the ground. Super seizure is the rearing of a young bee so that it can replace the old bee from a hive. Just generally when the young bee takes place, uh, is ready for laying eggs, then the queen bee, older bee, or mother bee we can say, she leaves the colony and then new uh, younger bee is now the new queen. Bee dance, they are of two types. They can be waggle or the round dance. Now there is a difference between the two. This is the waggle dance here and waggle dance is generally done when we can tell the direction as well as the distance of the flower patch. While this round dance is generally to locate the distance only. It does not give information about the direction. It only tells how much far or near the flower patch is. Now we will discuss some of the questions of apiculture. So the first question is the scientific name of dammer bees is um, the options Apis dorsata, Melipona eridipennis, Apis mellifera, Apis indica and Apis floria. The answer is Melipona eridipennis. We have studied it also known as stingless bee. In these sting is poorly developed. Next one is which of the following is pair is incorrect. So among these Italian bee that is Melipona eridipennis is the wrong option. Melipona eridipennis is the scientific name for stingless bee and Italian bee Epis mellifera. No summer disease of bee is caused by the correct answer among these option is microsporidian fungus. Earlier, earlier they were uh, known as protozoans but now they are classified under fungi only and microsporidia means that they are spore forming unicellular parasites. The nosema or nosemosis is caused by two species, nosema epis and nosema serene. They live in the gut cells of the honeybee and generally causes digestion disorders. The rearing of young bee to replace the old queen bee is called, right now only we have a study, it is known as super seizure. So the correct answer is option E. Bee venom is used for dash and released from dash glands. Among these options, which one is the right one? The correct answer is option A. Also, the glands, which are acid glands, are known as the poison glands in B. Scientists studied the method of communication in honeybee. These are the options. The correct option among this is Carl von Frisch. Now, he also won the Nobel Prize for studying the interpersonal communication in honeybee. And first time, the honeybee communicate by means of definite movement that is bee dance was discovered by Ernst Spitzner. Types of mouth part present in honeybee is 
rasping and sucking, chewing and lapping, chewing and biting, siphoning or none of these, the correct answer will be chewing and lapping type. Safest chemical for honeybee is, these are the options and among this, flubent diamide is the safest or we can say practically non-toxic chemical for honeybee. Rest all are extremely toxic. In honeybees, the queen substance is secreted by which of the gland is responsible for secretion of queen substance, which is the other name for it is queen mandibular pheromone. So, uh, this one is secreted by mandibular glands of queen bees only. For generally, this is to maintain, attract the males in the hive as well as to, um, lay, to maintain the sterility in the worker bees. This is very important. World Bee Day is celebrated on 20th August, 21st June, 24th December, 20th May or 26th November. The correct answer is 20th May. Also, you can join our new course of IBPS SOAFO, which has started from 30th April. And here, these are the expert faculties who will be teaching you. We will pro also provide video lessons, study notes, mock tests, and there is live doubt class with the expert faculty for IBPS SOAFO. Do not forget to subscribe and like our channel, iExamB. Also, don't forget to subscribe our AgriBee channel in which we regularly post the agriculture updates.